nigga kill over a bitch, but let a rat keep his wife. Time to go to work. Y'all hit the like button. Hit the subscribe button. I'm just trying to beat the eyes and you can help me. You. Why wouldn't you want to help me? Share this too. The other day, the Hot Boys reunited. They all was on stage together. Nobody, well, a, a lot of people didn't think this was going to happen because Turk been beefing with BG and Birdman. All because of the Drink Champs interview when, when he said they was wearing Geneva's. Imagine being Birdman rapping Rolly this, Rolly that in that moment, knowing that Turk just outed y'all and told that, nigga, that was Geneva's. It wasn't Rolly's. They put that to the side and got to that bag. In fact, BG was even rapping Turk lyrics. Birdman, not so much, but I caught him on a couple lyrics, but he pretty much went. When it was time for Turk to rap, he kind of fell back. So I could tell that that beef kind of still there. It's there. It ain't really went nowhere. But you know, when a bag involved and you got Lil Wayne involved, and, and, and Weezy, you know, he, he calling the shots like, Turk got to be here or I won't. Because that's, that's how I see it. Like, I think that's what happened. And that's why Turk was there. Because it's a blogger that Turk is into it with. And BG was on the comment, you know, kind of laughing up under on the comments, so it look like him and BG not, not that cool. It's just work. As usual. It even was an after party after. It was Juvie. It was Manny Fresh. And it was Turk at one spot. Then it was BG and brrr, what happened to that boy? It was a uh, Birdman, he, he was, him and BG, they was together at another spot at the after hour. Where y'all think Wayne went? I'm going to tell you. He went where Turk, Juvie, and Manny Fresh was at. Probably because he ain't want the street atmosphere. That's maybe. You know what I'm saying? Or he really picked his side. He knows something we don't know. I think he picked a side. If he didn't pick a side, it's probably just because he just wanted to. He just wanted a di different atmosphere, you know. When it come to BG, when it come to Birdman, he gonna put that on fire. So it's all type of gang members gonna be there. It's gonna be what it is. Probably turned out. But I want to know the relationship between Turk and BG. And the reason I say that, because Turk did go on his YouTube and he posted that BG was rapping his lyrics. Was he really feeling his lyrics? Undeniably, because on some of them songs, Turk had the best verse, especially high start so you had no choice but to vibe with it and BG had no choice because he felt that in his soul but the things they beefing over obviously if you could get on stage together that means there's room for improvement and growth and everybody to get over whatever they mad about and get this bag it looked like it's going to be up and coming dates for what they just did, I ain't saying it's dates available, but if they want a bag, they need to go ahead and do that. Put, put them dates together, hit the road, 
and get that bag. And Wayne did what Wayne do. Key to the city. He was up there, sound like he was whining on some of the songs, but they was hits. And I appreciate them. You know what I'm saying? Cause I grew up on I grew up on Lil Wayne. I grew up on the Hot Boys. So to see them perform and hear some old songs that probably don't even come to my head now. And to just hear them, like, brought back memories. So, shout out to them boys. And Turk, after all was said was done, this nigga want to go on the rant. He want to go live and talk to his fans and pretty much just violate them. Turk, what's wrong with you? You ain't make you. The fans make you. Your name come from the fans. Your stardom. The little stardom you got. Nigga, be grateful. You see what I'm saying? You get to a new level and you think you supposed to just pop it. Man, listen here. I rock with you. You get what I'm saying? But that right there just seemed like you just try to just shit on the people that support you. And they they have opinions and, and, and you got a problem with it like you not who you is. It's going to be opinions coming behind who you are and some of the moves you make. If you can't take the opinion, nigga. Stay off the internet. <laughs> and like I say, telling the truth I ain't hating. I like that. I, I like Turk. But going live to go off on your fans, man, that's cornball activity. If you was going off on somebody specific, nigga, put an address on it. But y'all leave a comment. Let me know what y'all think. Hit the like button. Hit the subscribe button. Appreciate you. I'll be back with another one.